Hey guys, welcome back to more AFK Arena. I finally got a match in the hunting field. So we're going to check it out. Once again, this is not a guide or anything. This is just taking a look at it. Um, so it's it's obviously Zafrael talking to us. I'm hoping he doesn't give us anything vital there because I never read any of that stuff. So standard here, let's go troops. So I get to select. Once again, I get these bad boys. So obviously I'm going to take Lucretia. I'm gonna, ooh, you, so you have to be elite plus, obviously. So I feel like Joke is always good. Irons, obviously. And this is me once again, assuming I probably should have read what she was saying. But let's just deploy everyone. And if I'm making mistakes, we can all learn from them. Arthur. Actually, do I have enough things that stay in the back row? I don't. I don't have enough things that stay in the back row. Actually, I believe Joker can stay behind Arthur. Um, we'll go with Taylene because it's Taylene. We'll go Alberto because Alberto. We'll go you and we go for some lockout action there. Okay. Could have taken the floor, but we didn't. So let's take a look. It's time for your dupes, troops to yada yada yada. Okay. So let, let's click there. So that's our goody goody stuff. So it looks like we've got another member there. So let's take a look at the map. Ooh, the map. And obviously we're working towards the top. So let's have a little browse through. So it does basically just have the feels of Abyssal Expedition, but it's a bit smaller. So then we have a Zafrael boss there. Ooh, we got some like weird random bosses in the middle. Not bad, not bad. Let's scroll up. And then obviously this is going to be the big, da the big daddy in the middle. So we need to get those squad ranks. So here we go. Here's our squad rank at the moment. This is my random squad that I got thrown in with. So we've got to occupy 10 level 1 camps. As you can see, we're at 7 because it's a team thing. It's not just me personally. Um, obtain 5 pieces of rare loot. Uh, collect 500 hunter marks. Reach tier 2 or higher with any hero uh, squad. Okay. Reach tier 2 with any hero. So I can upgrade this hero. Ah, so we get we, we get the items and that's where it talks about trading items. Okay, so we're going to be getting those items and trading them up to go ahead and make them work. So that is wicked. Uh, as you can see, people are chaining. So I'm stuck here. So I've got to, I've got to join in. And like I said in the previous video, these these like common camps here, these like open ground, the the wilderness, they're like permanent ones. This is a camp, so I'm actually going to fight it and occupy it. So let's just go ahead in and attack with our full cell hypo dimensional team. Uh, so we'll go with you. We'll go with you. We'll go with you. Like I probably don't need to use a full team. Except this one does have a Nara. So we're just going to bring you in that position. Like, this is probably wasteful because I'm well overpowered for that. So let's just let's just do this. We should be able to three-man this, surely. We've got no CC, though. Let's, let's see if we can three-man it. Don't show again. Put it on one-time speed. Just, just gauging the power levels, I feel like we should be able to just one-shot the world with irons. Is what I'm feeling. Yeah, okay, we probably didn't even need that much. Okay. Yeah, so we straight up shred it. Okay. Dunsky, so it's not even an issue. I could probably just solo some of these. Except CC might be an issue. So sa same sort of thing. Put the camps in, you get your stuff. Now I attack this one. Let's go ahead and battle it. Um, looks like the same enemies as well. So that cost me six. I want to see if I can like joker queen this stuff because i feel like it might be an option i'm ready to slow it down if i have to joker can you please proc something can queen solo this rip the dream <laughs> rip the absolute dream <laughs> oh it's such a waste it's such a waste all right uh do irons do you again we'll just do this team again screw it let's do Alberto. mix it up a little bit Okay, times four. Surely we just straight win this. Yep, happy days. I thought he was going to cheese us there. So that's it. Battle through those stages. Continue. Get that one. Because I want to link up with this guy. Listen, I'm not going to be efficient. Let's just go ahead and beat things. I'm not even going to worry about resources for this. Test server, first look, who cares? So let's do that. Beat you. 
Nice, moving on. Continue. Okay, now we're linked up. So what's this guy's power look like? Oh, and you get the unique things to upgrade specific heroes. You get general ones and unique ones. Okay, so rewards. Let's let's hit the info here. And uh, do, 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 damage. Do, do. After beast is killed, wait a while and more challenging beasts will spawn. Okay, so you basically beat them. You get the treasure chest. Dam damage will accumulate. Okay, battle history. Anyone battled it? Let's let's have a look. This is power out. Who cares? Let's just go in and let's do it. So let's go you, you, you. I believe Joker stays behind. So I, I like I think he stays in that in that range. We'll see. Although he's gonna jump anyway, so the Arthur's a bad idea. Nonetheless. What if we do this? What if we go like this? Uh we don't joke. I'm not gonna bring Joker. We'll go, we'll go something like this randomly. I want to see how this pans out. Don't remind me. Don't judge my team. Oh, the, he, the 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 Ninja Turtle didn't jump. He didn't do his jumpy jump on me jump thing. So I'm tipping you have to beat these things because these things are the way you get those items. I do like the Lucretia because he can't ult. He can't put his shield up. So that just lets us wail on him. But I feel like I could put together a better team. Although I can't really make good use of Arthur. And my twins are only elite. I really need elite plus twins for this. I've got, I've got, <laughs> I can use Celestials, but my twins are not there. Okay, so that's that. No reward drop. Okay. So let's just attack it again and get that reward drop. Wait, what did, what did I just do? Attack. Challenge. Insufficient ta challenge shields. Uh, how to acquire resource acquisition obtained from reaching specific squad level uh, request help from your squad mates so wh where do I request help support applications there will no longer be any limits to the number of support roles you can approve okay so I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I think I pretty much get the gist of it now. It took me a little bit, a little bit of reading. The annoying thing is the information that I looked at before I got into a party, like that whole information thing that I read in my last video about it, it's not anywhere. So I had to go back and look at my last video to see what the note said. I cannot find it anywhere here. Um, but anyway, basically, so the essence that we're getting, which is this stuff, which is basically if I go here and go... Uh, build uh it's called the hunter marks so the hunter marks are essentially essentially used to get the materials to upgrade a hero so as you can see this one we need this combination method we need that many of them we need 200 i'm at 118 or whatever it is now um so we can close that so that's how you wait to upgrade it you can also get items obviously by defeating these bosses and i'll make an actual guide on this once i you know, have my head completely around it. Um, but obviously I shouldn't have attacked yet. I should have waited, gathered more resources and got that because if we look here, battle history, that was just stupid. So when we go re resource acquisition, we can get them by um, reaching a certain squad level and request help from squad mates. So what that is, is I'm pretty sure when we go to the bag here, if we go to other and we go everyone, you can see everyone has these. So I used my challenge seal. I believe you can gift them to other members. So if we go back, go back into the bag here, um, like you can gift this stuff. So like I can give these as gifts to someone else to help them upgrade their hero quicker so that they can shred the boss um, and do that stuff. So let's go here, support application. Let's accept an application because I don't know what this does. I don't really know what that did, but I accepted it. So once again, this is just not a guide. I will do a guide on it, but um, I'm assuming that support person is like there for moral support, like they said in the instructions. So we'll have to wait and see, but pretty much this is where I'm at. I've got all my encampments waiting, generating resources, and I'm just going to hold out until I can upgrade um, some of my heroes, you know, get those decent upgrades into them, and then basically see where we go from there. So that's pretty much it. I think obviously we're going to have to progress up to the Khazard boss, then we progress up to the, where if I can see it can't see where's the map where's the map yeah there it is the zafrael boss and then we go to the final boss here so basically just basically abyssal expedition except instead of like classes you're upgrading specific heroes and you can trade items around to get them upgraded and it's obviously a lot smaller and uh gonna be quicker so 
not too bad. Like, I don't feel like I've had to invest a hell of a lot, except for just trying to understand it. I haven't invested too much time into it, so it's not too bad at the moment. Like I said, really good that the common tiles just stay locked forever, which is really, really nice. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much where we are going to leave this one. I definitely do like that they have like those actual buildings that you can capture, not tiles. Because capturing tiles, abandoning tiles, it was just it was just irritating. But uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Once again, I will be back before it drops on global with an actual guide for it. We'll look at pathing, we'll look at teams, all that sort of stuff. Um, but yeah, for now, that is where it is at. Don't attack straight away is the first tip that I've just found out for myself. But anyway, guys, that is going to be for this one. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day, and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next one. Cheers.